guys, I'm at SEMA in Las Vegas and I spotted a company that I'd never seen before and probably you guys are first time here, right? So this yeah. is our first time here, but the company's been around for 15 years. Okay, so uh, introduce yourself and tell us all about your company. So my name is Javon. I am the West Coast rep for MDC USA. Uh, this is our first time at SEMA. Love Vegas. Best place to show off this <laughs> unit. Um, but yeah, the uh, company's been around for 15 years. This is our first year in the industry for the RV industry. We're going nice. to all of the dealerships in America. Um, and a cool, cool, cool part of what we do is we've dialed in overlanding. When it comes to overlanding, we've dialed out, mastered that art. Uh, one of the things that makes us a little bit different than most of the manufacturers out here is gonna be quality. We pride ourselves on quality and also the goodies that come with it. For example, I'm gonna show you down here. We have a suspension system that is super robust. That is gonna be our tough track suspension system. So what you will see down there is gonna be your dual gas struts, dual trail arms, retention chain so it doesn't overextend and also a larger bore spring this is just like any independent suspension system with a little bit of steroids added to it i mean it's just a beast when you look at it that has got to be the beefiest suspension i've ever oh, seen on a trailer. Now, let me yeah. show you the hitch so i've actually have this unit right here that we see this is what i tow every day this comes with me everywhere i went to Heaven's Falls, Texas, uh, to do a little demo in an overland rock climbing scenario. And one of the things that people just loved and did extremely well for me was this hitch system. This is the Cruise Master hitch system, standard in every one of our units. Everything you see standard, there's no options. Everything comes with it. What makes this so valuable for the overlander is the fact that this will articulate 300 degrees as you saw. It's also gonna do 70 degrees up and down and the positive locking mechanism that comes with it makes it so easy to just lock into place peace of mind worry free it locks into place you don't even have to worry about it another cool feature up front and we're only in the front right now is going to be our sway control system so we have a automatic sway control system that's built into the unit already what that does it applies and distributes pressure to each one of the brakes to stop and minimize the sway from actually happening and not only that if I'm distracted in the car, I'm listening to music, just not paying attention, or I'm driving, a message will actually pop up on my dash letting me know that I'm swaying and to slow down. So safety first, safety first. Nice. Um, up here, you're also gonna have the water spigot and a brake system. So the way that we test this brake system, this gets rid of the chalk blocks. And you will no longer need your blocks. Oh, wow. The way that we use this is literally, you just hand pull it. And we actually take the time to test it by taking a tow truck and elevating it at different degrees to make sure that it actually works for us. So yeah, we are built on quality, everything's tested. The building construction on this is gonna be a hot dip galvanized steel. That is what you're gonna need if you're going overlanding. You don't wanna break anything out there, you don't wanna bed anything out there. Nice, I like this by the way, the rock guard. Oh yeah, it's yeah. a beautiful rock guard. And as you felt, as you're knocking on it, everything's super solid, well built, I mean, there's YouTube videos of people in Australia using this unit, rolling it over and literally just getting scratches <laughs> on it. I mean, if you go down the road now in America, you're going down the road, you'll see a, a unit maybe fall on the side or roll over. It's completely in pieces throughout the whole road. With I've these seen guys, that myself. yes. Yeah. I mean, we've all seen it. You know, <laughs> you're driving down the yeah. 90, you see that happening. Yeah. But no, these are built to last. Quality detail is what we're really focused on. Nice, nice. So two propane bottles and what else? The batteries? Two propane what? bottles come standard. Batteries, let me tell you about batteries. So this is gonna be for your jerry cans. Oh, Gas, right, jerry diesel, cans, yeah. you know, you name it, water, you put them up there. But on top, we're gonna to have a 700 watt solar system. So we got 700 watts on the top, 200 amp hour lithium phosphate battery. That is a self-heated battery that's inside of the unit. That's gonna power the whole house. So all of the lights that are in there, the refrigerators, all of that is being powered by that. So my last trip was 90 days. And in those 90 days, I mean, I always had the refrigerators on. Not once did I have to recharge the battery. Um, I wasn't using the lights all the time. They were on and off throughout the five hours that I was there. Uh, but other than that, I was driving down the highway, letting it charge, never had to recharge the battery That's at the all. Best. So out here, you're gonna have this beautiful outside kitchen. You're gonna have these slow closed drawers, these hinges, flip down to get out of the way and i mean for my beer i gotta have my bottle opener there but yeah this is a beautiful beautiful outside kitchen it also comes with 
this light system for your outside refrigerator, even though we have a full kitchen inside, you're still gonna have kitchen and refrigerator on the outside as well. There's also a four season room that will fully enclose all of this. So you have your picnic area, you're gonna have your kitchen, you're gonna have your refrigerator on the outside. Four season room drops down, fully encloses it from bottom to side. Now you have expanded your square footage on this unit. You're gonna come standard with a dual spare tire. So you're gonna have the large spare tires. They're not gonna be smaller tires. They're gonna be the same tires that you're using. So if you ever pop anything when you're on the road overlanding, you always got two spares with you. There's also gonna be 360 lightings throughout the whole camper. And that little bad boy right there, that's gonna be a backup camera. Like I said, everything comes standard. Nice. These windows, super cool. Open up all the way, close all the way. They are dual pane windows. Boom, easy to use. This is one of the cleanest solar systems that I've seen. Beautiful details. Everything's clean, no shake. Everything's well put together. Nice. So this is what's running our whole house. Inside, you're also gonna have your kitchen, three burner stove. That's gonna be an enamel grill, that way nothing sticks to it. You're gonna have your hot and cold water here, TV, oven, boom, everything you need. Awesome cabinetry. So these are super easy to use. All you do is push, twist, pull up, and as you see inside, everything, everything's gonna be fully finished for you. It's like a boat. It is like a boat. That is what they tell me. It's a boat on wheels. <laughs> the floor construction is gonna be a honeycomb composite. That is one of the things that makes it special is the fact that there is very minimum wood use in this unit. So the floor won't rot on you. It won't warp, never be spongy. And then take a look at this beautiful bathroom. I will get out of the way. So we've been at SEMA for two days. And one thing that people just can't stop talking about is how beautiful and big that bathroom is. Let me open that for you. Oh, I see. Yeah, this is like a five star hotel in here. That has got to be one of the nicest bathrooms I've ever seen in a travel trailer. <laughs> that is nice. You guys don't call them travel trailers though, do you? No, you in Australia them, they call them vans. Vans? vans? Yep, caravans. <laughs> caravans, okay. And you got to say mate right after that, so <laughs> it's caravan, mate. My Australian's not very good, I'm trying. Does this turn into a bed too? Is that what that So is? yes, this is a bunk. Uh, you're able to drop down this, and it's super easy to do. All you do is click here, boom, pops into place. Two little levers here, pop oh, down. Yeah. Now you got a bunk area. And it doesn't stop there, like I told you, I feel like ShamWow. <laughs> this is a rest foot area. Super cool, little neat idea. Two little handles, pops down. Great nice. design, great use of space and the colors just makes it look huge. Looks premium. Yeah. Yep. And the mattress, it comes with an awesome pillow top queen size mattress. And it's not an RV queen. This is gonna be 62 by 80. Wow. So that means if you decide that you want a Serta or you want any type of residential bedding, you're able to just replace it as well. It's like better than the bed I have at home. <laughs> <laughs> so is this, does that open out? So yes. Zombie apocalypse hits us, you're able to put anything up there. You could ha you have access to it. So you can crawl up there. You could crawl up there. Oh, yes, you nice. can. Can I crawl up there? I don't know about that. My, <laughs> my pull-ups are not very good, but yes. <laughs> nice, nice. AC, obviously. Yep, you're going to have the 110 AC. Literally, it gets like an ice box in here. Just the size of it, the power of the 13.5. I mean, no matter where you are, Texas, Arizona, Louisiana, where it's hot and humid, you get the beautiful combination of both. You stay cool the whole time. So generator will run that? Is that oh yeah, any generator will run that. You know, you got a small portable generator because the cool thing is everything that you see is already powered by that battery. Mm -hmm. All you're gonna need that for is gonna be that generator, that small generator. So you don't need a generator to power the whole house. Mm -hmm. Just that, everything else is being powered off of your house battery. Nice. Uh, a couple questions. Yes. How much water does this hold? So our standard is gonna be 42 gallons of water. Each one of those tanks is gonna be an inch thick. They're gonna be diamond plated to protect it as well. And on top of it, we do put heat pads on each one. Oh. So for those guys that are going out in the winter, hunting, fishing, anything like that, they're gonna be heated. We also use a Truma Comfort Go Plus water heater. So that is your instant water heater. So you have water on demand and it's the biggest one, the 60K. We don't skimp on anything. That will also circulate water throughout the unit, the plumbing. That way things should not freeze at all. Nice. 
And then the tanks for the gray and black, how much are those? So the actual gray is going to be 22. And what we've done for the Overlander is we don't have black tanks. So we do the same style that you would find in a B-class van, those beautiful vans. Mm -hmm. We have a cassette toilet. And that allows you to be able to just take the things out. Right out you yeah. could, yep, you could dispose of them anywhere. So it's super easy. You don't have to go to a campground to do like those. That. Yeah, it's, it's easy to find a place to dump. Can you show us the other floor pan too? Yep, let's go through that one. This is our newest floor plan that just came out this year. Dealers love it, public loves it. So this is going to be our family edition. This is a bunkhouse edition. Same things that you're going to get with that unit over there, the 16 East West, the beautiful kitchen, the outside refrigerator, TV, the outlet, the picnic area, the four season room out here. You get with this as well. But we added a little bit extra. So check this out. I'm out here cooking on the stove or I'm cooking inside. I am able to use this pantry oh, two ways. Cool. I could keep all of my <laughs> goods here that I use for cooking and yeah. I could cook either on the inside or on the outside of the unit. That's nice. Vice versa. So yes, I whenever you're ready to grill out, let me know. I'm I, ready to eat, brother. I was going to say, I, didn't, I don't think I've seen anybody else do this one. That's Industry cool. first, man. Like I, I said, we're, we're just disrupting things here. Yeah. So. <laughs> so this is our wow. family. So as you see here, Five people could sleep here. However, if you want to turn this into a couch, we have a backer for it. Now you have a beautiful couch there. You're able to see out the window, fans everywhere. We're going to have fans right here in that area. But let's say it's nap time. We got to go to sleep. It's nighttime. So all you do is you just bring this down, snaps into place. Oh, I love it. And now you have a locked in bunk. Your uh, ladder will go here, comes with the ladder. Everything you see standard, locks into place, boom. Ready to go, ready to sleep. Disengage it, boom. I got Super easy kids to use. And I already know this is the floor fan right here for me, right here. This is nice. Storage. This turns into a bed too. So you got this bed, that bed, and that bed. That drops down. Uh, yes, this is gonna be your cozy drop down bunk area. Um, we also did drawers underneath. Super clean hinge slide system. You still have your marine grade cabinetry. You still have your marine grade hinges. I mean, it's, it's a beautiful floor plan. And once again, the way that James out there styles this, picks the product, it's just amazing. Same quality. Everything in here is super clean. Everything's well done. Fit and finish is just amazing. What, what material is this? So it's going to be a veneer. So it's going to be a composite veneer that's going to be on the cabinetry. So is it is it wood with composite on top? Yes, yes. Oh, I see. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha. Nice. This, this right here is a game changer for a lot of people because it's hard to find a small camper that can fit three kids and then mom and dad. Yep. That's pretty nice. And there's no slide outs. Um, I know that in America we love slide outs. Uh, but when you're overlanding, you want to minimize any moving pieces, any moving yeah. parts. Um, so yeah, no slide out. Very we nice. still get the whole family in here. Oh, you didn't show us this and this. Oh, yeah. so this is yeah. going to be our Thetford refrigerator. This is a 12 volt refrigerator. And like I said, you're going to have your fridge. You're going to have your freezer. Plenty of room for ice cream. I know we love our ice cream, so plenty of room for it. And like I mentioned earlier to you, I've used this refrigerator and my model for over 90 days without having to charge the battery, without having to plug into the shore power. It's off grid. Off grid 100%. All of your controllers are gonna be there. So this is the main reason why I'm able to go off grid and not use power uh, consumption like crazy. Each one of the components will have switches, toggle switches that I can turn on, turn off, as you see, turned off, uh, so that I am able to conserve energy. So if I'm not using it, I turn it off, don't need it and surf my battery led lights in here they're not running much and most of the time that i'm in here the output for it will be between 12 to 15 amps depending on the day so yeah it's a great product bathroom so to save some space we did do a wet bath in this this is going to be a large wet bath you're able to get everything in their mirror take a shower let me get in here i always like to uh Sure, what it looks like. Check it out. So I'm about 5'10 with shoes on, and I got plenty of room in here. Look at that. There's your sink. Very cool. And is this cassette as well, right? Yes, sir. 
and it doesn't stop there but there's more wait there's more um there is an outside shower that comes standard with this so just like everybody else in the industry we're going to have an outside shower yeah. however we've added an outside shower that has a tent room outside so that you're able to have privacy you zip it up fully encloses the feet fully encloses your sides you have a light with it you have your shower head so if you're at the beach you got a little a little sand on your feet you're able to go in there rinse off and then just come back out and have fun with your family keep this place clean yeah yep and then probably the same features for the kitchen as same the exact part. features we're going to have your three burners you're going to have your uh cold and hot sink here to make sure that you could uh wash anything do anything that you want plenty of, of cabinetry that's well that's that's what i was gonna say there is cabinetry and cabinetry on top of cabinetry so any place that you could store something it's ready for you and like i said this is that cool feature that you were talking about earlier the pantry yeah. where you have the pantry inside and outside nice where would guys in america buy this app to check the uh, so i would go on the website there's a dealer portal there where they're able to see what dealers are in the area cool right on there you go guys so uh let's get the website and then we'll be out of here what's the website mdcusa.com there you go escape with confidence nice all right there you go guys was that not amazing that was pretty nuts this is uh by far the nicest travel trailer or caravan you will ever see these things are amazing and they can go anywhere too very cool